hello guys welcome to tutorial race in this video you are learning drupal training drupal 10 and 11 so guys in this video i'm going to show you how we can create custom header and custom footer in drupal theme in the previous video i had demonstrated you that how you can create any theme from scratch in this video i will show you that how we can create custom header and custom footer as well because if as a developer you may need this that you may need to you know create custom header and custom footer also in the previous video uh, i had just included page header and for page footer but in this one i will create separate page header and a separate page footer and then include into our page uh, twig file so guys step by step i will show you that how we can create that let's start so before we so before we proceed ahead we need to understand regions here we have regions header content and footer we will uh, work on that and also if you go to here in the structure and then if you check block layout in that case in case you have not followed my previous video that how to create a custom new theme in that case i strongly recommend you to check that first then you will understand it better if you check here block layout then you can see this is the header and this is the footer and this is the content so what i so what uh, we had done here in the previous one uh, this one actually let's create it so for tutorial and in the previous uh, one what we had done directly we had included here right but in some cases uh, you may need to create a totally custom header and custom footer in that case what we will do in layout section let's create here two files the first one will be let's go here and check yeah so inside our templates layout we will create header html dot tweak file that means template file so click here and then create a new tweak file here similarly we will create footer as well so now in the header section we will just put this kind of code here it's very basic you can see this is html code the main point is we are variable we are displaying this variable global variable site name and uh, guys here page header so why we write this this is dynamic uh, regions so whatever you will assign in the, into the admin so what i mean let me show you whatever you will be assigning here in the admin said in the header it will display here so that means this is dynamic region so whatever <coughs> you will be assigning there it will display in that particular region that's why we are writing this code this page header okay now here uh, right now we will include footer also so in for that purpose once again we will create it in inside our layout file this one as well okay now let's go here and then it's very simple this code also we will here include here footer and here we are just calling this page footer that means what this section will be also dynamic that means whatever uh, block will be assigned from the admin section it will display inside this region okay but these two sections will be fixed here all right so now we will include into our page dot tweak so rather than this we will direct what we have done in previously we had directly in uh, directly put here page header and page footer in the bottom here you can see in line number 11 but now what we will do now we will write include code okay so for that we need to go here and guys you can see uh, in main section we will write something like this okay let's replace it's very concise and very simple so what we are doing we are calling here let's put we are calling here uh, header what we have we have just created and then we are calling here what this footer so it's more convenient and more conceivable concise and more configurable okay customizable so guys now we will see that how does it look like now for that we need to go here and of course we need to uh, clear the cache so let's control this here and then performance in here clear cache now if you check here refresh new page 
site encountered problem so there is some poor problem i think let's check okay the re the reason is actually this is junk character we just copied it no? that's why it will be single quote here and also there is problem in this so this is fine this one looks fine and also you can see this one also there is junk character no? so that can be the region anywhere else single quote double quote this one is fine this one is fine okay now let's try let's clear the cache once again and now let's check here you guys now perfectly it is coming here this is the header this is the content section and this one is the footer okay so guys as you can see or inside the footer there might be not any regions that why it's, uh, you cannot see there so let's check here the footer section footer footer yeah there is no any page block that's why it is showing footer what i will do i will create a new page block so i will name it as hello footer in here as well hello footer okay now save it and then once again cache clear now let's try and check it should appear inside the footer did it really assign hello footer inside the footer section let's check structure block layout footer footer yeah inside the footer actually there is nothing so hello footer this one we need to say block inside the footer so now inside the footer it has come now it should be visible let's see if it's coming or not then we can yeah guys you can see now this is coming so this is cu customizable area so this way you can create custom header and custom footer in your theme and you can include it's very simple you can see here we are including here header and this one the footer and we are writing a separate code it is more convenient and customizable right so guys hope you like this video and in the next video i will show you that how we can create custom template for example there are different uh, post type now so suppose you have uh, about services and uh, uh, about works services different pages and all the pages have different design this is very important all the three pages suppose there are three pages so all the three pages have different design in that case how we can create separate design completely with node so i will show you step by step so stay connected in the next video let's match thank you